In this video, we're going to take a look at navigating the Unity viewport, the scene viewport to be specific, using Maya style navigation. Now, even if Unity doesn't specifically refer to this as Maya style navigation, it is exactly the same viewport navigation system that's been in Maya forever. So all of you Maya people out there, you're already right at home with moving around in these viewports. And if you're new to Maya, this is just one of the many ways you can get around in the viewport. It all comes down to using the Alt key, which if you're a Mac user, that should be the Option key. If you hold down the Alt key, now I'm on Windows, so I'll be saying Alt all the time. You Mac people know to swap that out for the Option key in your head. If you hold down the Alt key and drag with your left mouse button, you'll see that you can tumble your view. We're rotating around. So here I have this little campsite, and we are rotating around it. If we hold down Alt, and click down with our middle mouse button. Now, if you, you, know, you, most of you probably have a three button mouse. If you don't, then you should probably consider getting one. If you don't see your third button and you don't know where it is, it's going to be under your mouse wheel. Click your mouse wheel down, and that is your middle button. This allows you to pan the camera. We can slide to the left by dragging that, uh, dragging to the right. Technically, we drag the camera to the right, and you see we slide to the left. It's kind of like dragging the world around. We can go in the other direction, and we can go up and down. This motion, this lateral style motion, is called panning the camera. Now, if we hold down Alt and we drag with the right mouse button, we can dolly the camera in and out. Technically, this is not zooming, but a lot of folks do call this zooming, and that's generally okay as long as you do know the difference. That zooming a camera means changing the, the field, field of view. The field of view. That's right. So that your your lenses are actually changing. So there is a difference, but again, if you find yourself slipping and calling it zooming, I do it too. Don't feel too bad about it. Now, all of that said, just a really quick review. We hold down Alt, left mouse to tumble, middle mouse to pan, right mouse to dolly in and out. But there's one more thing I want to point out, because if you are a Maya user, uh, then perhaps you haven't seen this kind of behavior before, but your cursor will wrap while you're doing this kind of thing. So watch this. As I hold down the Alt key and I drag with left mouse, watch my cursor very carefully. It's moving to the edge of the viewport, and now it's crossing over to the edge of the Unity interface, and now check it out. It's actually wrapped around to the left side of the interface, and it'll just keep wrapping over and over again. If you're not ready for that, it can be a little bit startling the first couple of times you do it. So uh, be aware that it, that is going to happen. It also happens vertically as we dolly in and out. So notice my cursor is going up the screen, and once it gets to the top, it wraps back around to the bottom. So where Maya folks, we have always had to kind of let off the mouse and you know click several different times to get to a certain location. Here we just have wrapping and it does make things easy once you get the hang of it. So that is uh, the Maya style navigation available to you when you are navigating your scene view inside of Unity. One more time just to beat the dead horse, it is Alt, left mouse to tumble, middle mouse to pan, right mouse to zoom, and is there anything else you want to throw out? What about your scroll wheel? Oh, I actually forgot about that. You can use your scroll wheel to dolly in and out. I never do it. It's a habit I never picked up, which is why I actually forgot to mention it. But yeah, <laughs> absolutely. If you want to dolly in and out with a scroll wheel, you have access to that too. So we'll throw that in, kind of wedge that in right there at the very end. But uh, that is going to wrap things up for this video. Thanks a lot.